sitting in front of you. Dr. Rajit Kumar Tyagi and Dr. Kapil Kumar, the two brothers who started this journey, uh, the chairman and managing director. Uh, the journey was started from a small, uh, you know, uh, they belong to a small village in Uttar Pradesh. Uh, and since uh, 2008 when, is when the company was incorporated and since then, for the last uh, you know, few years, that's the journey you saw on the presentation there. I myself joined the company in 2019. Uh, before that, I was in UK. I was uh, doing my healthcare management in Imperial College, London. And there's a strong board of independent, uh, independent directors we have, Mr. Mukesh Sharma, who's uh, ex-chairman of Nanital Bank. Dr. Sanjeev Upate, he's a renowned personality in the field of healthcare, yeah. and he was with UNICEF earlier. And Mrs. Pramila Bhardwaj, uh, she's an ex-IRS, who was also on the board of Tata Sons. Then over the course of last uh, four, four and a half years back is where we professionalized this company. And Mr. Amit Singh, the group CEO joined, who will also be taking the later part of this presentation after me. Uh, we have uh, Mr. Pankaj Prabhatar, who's the group's CFO. Uh, Mr. Ritesh Sharma, who's the company secretary, and Mr. Deepak, who is seeing the president and finance and strategy. So as I was telling you, the journey started in 2008, uh, where you know we incorporated this company. In 2010, our first hospital started in the city of Greater Noida. It was that time only a 100 bedded hospital. In 2013 is where we, we started the 250 bedded Noida Hospital, which is a super specialty hospital. Uh, that time the Greater Noida Hospital started doing very good in numbers, so we felt the need to expand this hospital. And in 2018, we expanded the Greater Noida Hospital from 100 bedded to 400 bedded hospital. In 2019, we came up with our group's, as of now, largest hospital of 450 bedded. Uh, in Nord extension and then recently in 2022 that's when we moved out of Delhi and Sia and expanded uh, in the territory of Chhansi Ocha in Madhya Pradesh and we acquired a 305 uh, bedded hospital. It's a huge hospital spread across 11 acres of land. I'll give you the key overview of the business operators, the key metrics. So as of now we have four hospitals. Uh, we are 1,405 beds, out of which 394 critical care beds. So uh, we have a high ratio of uh, critical care beds to our overall capacity. Around 609 doctors are working with us. We have 10 centers of excellence. These centers of excellence are the super specialties which focus, uh, which contribute to a larger part of our uh, overall revenue. Overall uh, occupancy is 45.3%, but I'll break up uh, this occupancy hospital by hospital so you'll get a clear idea of the occupancy. ARPOP, that is average revenue per occupied bed, is 26,538 and ALOS, average length of stay, is 4.32 days. EBITDA margins is 25.7%, this is uh, for fiscal 23 and net profit margins 12.6%, ROC 26.1% and ROE of 36%. As we were mentioning earlier, two of our hospitals are among the top 10 largest uh, private hospital present in Delhi NCR in terms of number of beds in fiscal 2023. So that is the Nord Extension Hospital which is 450 bed and the Great Noda Hospital which is 400 bed. And I'll also share with you that these are the two hospitals that you know we are looking to expand uh, in terms of bed capacity. Recently uh, the Yathat Hospital Greater Noida which is a 400 bed hospital we acquired the adjacent land to it and uh, you know we are going to expand our capacity in the coming years there. As well as for Yathar Hospital Nord Extension, we acquired the land passages adjacent to the hospital on the back side and uh, we uh, were the highest bidders there actually for this uh, land recently. Uh, so soon uh, there are also plans to expand the bed capacity in this hospital as well. This is the Great Noda Hospital. This is the first hospital that we started in 2010. At that time it was 100 bed hospital. But uh, in 2018 when we re revamped it to a 400 bed hospital. So as you can see from the building there, this is used to be an early 100 bed building and then this is the new building which we revamped and the whole hospital has now capacity of 400 beds. Uh, as far as the revenue is concerned, so this hospital in financial 21 was 81 crores, to, it became to 170 crores and then uh, 199 crores in financial year 23. So that is the growth it has seen in terms of revenue which is around 57% covered from financial 21 to 23. This is a Noida hospital. This is, uh, we started in 2013. So one of our, uh, you know, even though Great Noida was the first hospital, but 2018 it revamped to 400 beds. So Noida, as of now, uh, you can say is one of our uh, most matured hospital. Uh, and uh, this is a hospital which we're seeing a really good uh, bed occupancy. So in last year, this hospital had an occupancy of overall 87.9%. Uh, as well as the revenue as well, in last three years, it has grown CAGR of 59%. 
from 21, 68 crores to 128 crores and then 172 crores. So this is the growth that has happened in a Noida hospital. This is the Noida extension, the latest hospital in 2019. Uh, we started this hospital. Uh, but technically, if you look at it, when we started this hospital for first two years, uh, majority of the months in a year, this hospital was a full uh, private COVID hospital. And I would like to share that this hospital was one of the biggest uh, private COVID hospital that time available uh, across Uttar Pradesh. So this hospital really did some amazing work as far as COVID is concerned. Uh, we did a great service to humanity in the areas that we were offering uh, the COVID services that time because we were really first uh, two years was purely COVID. So uh, after that post COVID is when this hospital started uh, complete overall non-COVID operations. So last year it had an occupancy of 30%, 31.3% to be exact. And if you look at the CAGR growth in terms of revenue from 79 crores to 102 crores and then latest year did around 135 crores. So all uh, our four hospitals including the Jhansi Osha that I will cover are aggregated with NABH. NABH is the highest uh, quality aggregation uh, that you have in India for hospitals. Uh, two of our hospitals are also NABL aggregated. That is the highest quality you have for uh, pathology services, the labs. Uh, that we have in, in India and uh, this not extension hospital we have also applied for JCI which is the highest quality aggregation worldwide uh, that you get.